What's up guys, here's Claudio from Visual Moto WordPress Teams and in today's video I'm gonna explain how to fix this issue that used to appear when you import a WordPress theme demo contents and this theme offers slider revolution. So this is a very common error, okay? Oops, no sliders fine, please add at least one slide template to chosen language, okay? This is a very normal error, okay? Into this case, it's a post-based slider using slider revolution. I'm gonna leave a link in the description below and a card over here explaining more about how to create post-based slider. However, sometimes you see this issue and I'm gonna explain two methods to fix this issue, okay? Normally, it's used to happen because the slider is applied on the page, but it's trying to call a slider that does not exist or isn't set as yet, okay? And this is what we're gonna learn to fix. But please, before we can start, take a moment to hit the subscribe button, like this video, and share this content with a friend of yours. You have no idea how much it helps us, okay? And for this video, I want to start on the WordPress dashboard as usual, okay? And from the dashboard, you can see into the left side of menus, into the very bottom of your page, okay? The, up the bottom left corner we can see slider revolution and the slider right here it's called post slider so this is the slider title and here is my post slider okay into the is the models i'm gonna hover my mouse over it and click on edit of course you can click on edit model post slider button right here or you can click into the revolution slider right here okay This is gonna load the posts based slider. This is the template, and there's no much we can do right here because you already imported the pre built template, okay? So, nothing much to edit. We, the only things that we're gonna be looking for is the sources, okay? So, what we're gonna need to do, we're gonna need to move to the have a look at the sidebar, the right sidebar, okay? Into this gear icon we're gonna be looking at next to layout the content okay right here click on it and the source it's post based okay this slider gonna call the featured image and the titles from the last latest posts of your blog you screw it down just a little bit and this is the guy that we need to set post selection okay this is the most important part and this is what we're gonna fix the issue categories and now we need to call the categories, okay? So this is what isn't set into this post, based slider. As soon as you select one of those categories, let me choose this one that have 11 posts and save the slider. As soon as I do this, let me show you the slider again. This is what we have instead of this, okay? The issue is now fixed. Simple, easy and effective. There is other forms to fix. For example, let me let's imagine that you would like to remove this slider from the page. Okay, you do not want to have a slider on the page, but you still see this error banner. You most need to remove. This is an alternative way to fix. Go to edit page into the top of your WordPress shortcodes next to your navigation menu. This gonna load the page editor. According to the theme that you are using, you may see a different editor right here. The slider revolution can be an element on this page content, but if you are using a visual model theme, you're gonna need to screw the page down just a little bit. And here where you see slider revolution and the post slider being called, you can select no. As soon as you do this, the slider gonna be removed and this error banner as well, okay? Simple, easy and effective. Another way to fix this issue is make sure that you are calling the proper slider, whoever, because you can apply the slider shortcode. However, if you try to use the slider shortcode without calling the proper slider, you're gonna see this error as well. And to fix it, you need to go to our page editor. Make sure you remove the slider that you have on your page. It can be an element like this one. Let me show you. Like this, for example. It can be a, a page like this, right here. 
If I click on slider revolution and do not select a slider, I see an error like this, so I must select a slider that does exist on our site. Same for the element right here, same for Elementor in the case that I'm using Elementor, same for the slider shortcode, let me show you the slider shortcode. Let me grab the slider short code. Here is the short code. You can call the slider in all of those ways on your page, okay? However, if you are seeing this issue, it means that there is something wrong with your short code. Probably you will call it the short code on the slider, but the slider has been deleted or the slider does not exist. And in this case, all you have to do to fix is delete this short code, remove this short code, and apply the working one. Okay, so if you're using visual mode, click on slider revolution, select the slider, and you are good to go. Or go to the slider, click on embed, copy the short code, and place on the page. And it is. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Feel free to use the comment section below in the case that you have any question. And don't forget to install our free Borderless WordPress plugin on WordPress dashboard plugins at new and search for Borderless install and activate. This is gonna give you more widgets, elements, templates, tools like Icon Uploader, custom post types, demo websites that you can import with a single click, okay, like pre-built websites. All absolutely for free. In addition, in the case that you are in need of an amazing free WordPress team with premium features absolutely for free, go to our WordPress dashboard, appearance, themes, add new and search for Enzo. Install and activate it. This team gonna give you pre-built websites and templates as well, okay? Moreover, in the case that you want pro templates, premium icons, extra image and our full support while doing your site to make it work ASAP and properly in the way that you want, go to visualmodo.com and purchase our Visual Modo Pass product in order to go premium and can choose almost unlimited pre-built websites, all importable with a single click, for example, ready pages, ready sections, or full support, seven days per week, and that is. I hope you guys enjoyed this video, and I see you tomorrow. All the best!